पनीर पसंदा पसंदा मीन्स पसंद दैट मीन्स लाइक एवरीबडी लव पनीर पसंदा एंड सो डज विकी नाउ वेन आई मेक दिस रेसिपी आई डोंट मेक इट वेरी ऑफन बट वेन एव आई मेक इट आई ट्राइंड ऑफ चेंज माई स्टाइल समटाइम्स आई चेंज द मसाला समटाइम्स आई चेंज द फीलिंग बट जनरली जो पनीर पसंदा है इट इज एन अडेप्टेशन ऑफ अ नॉन वेजिटेरियन डिशेज वेर अ पसंदा विच मीन्स अ फाइनली in flattened escalope or scallopini or a piece of meat okay that's the cut of meat which was used everything in india has to have a vegetarian equivalent to it so here we have the pasanda so we have a nice piece of paneer here where i'm going to be just cutting it into like thin slices just like this okay nice so we've got nice three slices of paneer here so first things first let's get on by making a really kick ass filling so i've got some cashew nuts here about 25 grams of cashew nuts i've got five to six almonds here and here i'm adding a nice big a third of a cup of fresh mint and then i've got some got good half a cup of fresh coriander in this into this i'm adding a little bit of cardamom powder okay thodi si elaichi dal rahe hain we're putting about two chilies in here okay two to three chilies in this we're going to be adding a nice big clove of garlic okay i would say about two teaspoons of garlic two teaspoons of ginger okay perfect i've got some paneer left here so all your trimmings etc can be also very nicely added on this next i'm going to be adding a little bit of salt to this and just a pinch of sugar okay and now we're going to give this a nice blend so i'm just literally going to add a few drops of water not too much and then we're going to give this a nice mix so we have our lovely almost like a chutney and nut flavored filling which is outstanding look at that how gorgeous it is so you can see it's a nice filling which is kind of clumped together okay beautifully like this okay so you know you have to make sure that zyada pani nahi dalna chahiye aapko isme okay so that you get almost like a very coarse stiff paste to this okay we have our lovely paneer here which i am going to be just smearing this filling on top on which i'm going to be adding an other piece of paneer just like this so literally there are you will find many versions of this on google on the net you'll find a lot of stuff where there are different kinds of fillings sometimes even you can make a roll another top here beautiful nice to ye abhi hamara bilkul filling taiyar ho gayi hai and we have a very nice lovely beautiful pasanda here now we have to make like a nice rich gravy ka base okay for that here i have one medium sized onion which i'm putting in here along with that i'm putting about 8 to 10 cashew nuts yeah it is a very rich recipe if you know what i mean uh three green chilies okay ek do tej patte do kali ilaichi and about 8 to 9 cloves okay perfecto abhi hum dalenge isme a little bit of turmeric a little bit of salt yeah and just that's and just a little bit of red chili powder not too much okay so now we've got all these things going on we also have two cloves of garlic beautiful and then you have a nice piece of ginger i would say about 10 to 15 grams okay nice next we're going to be adding about 250 ml to 300 ml of water just in order to cook this over here okay so i've got my my onion gravy base kind of cooking Now what I'm just waiting for this to come up to a boil and then I'm going to be blending this but in the meanwhile let's start slowly getting ready for 
the main tempering for this gravy. So our onion base, okay, our gravy, okay, our pre-gravy, I would say, is almost ready, okay. So what do we have here? In case you missed out, we have a couple of bay leaves. We have two nice buddy moti lychee, to which we have a little bit of ginger, garlic, green chilies, long, haldi, that's just turmeric, and a pinch of red chilli powder. That's it. Now what we're going to do here is we are going to smartly switch this off and I'm going to be making a nice base for this, okay? So this is literally almost like making an, an, an onion gravy, okay? So I'm just going to put this here, okay? I'm going to be definitely using up this stock or water as we call it uh, with the gravy. We're going to use it to, to give more body to it. It's going to give a nice liquid. And you know what, I love this whole flavor, this entire flavor profile because once the ginger, the garlic, the nuts, the cloves and the turmeric and the salt get blended together, it's going to make one lush of a gravy we are looking at. And then after this, tempering it with our present butter. Oh my God. So we've got most of our water, in fact, all of our water in here. Beautiful. And now for our final dance, as we call it. So using a little salted butter. Now this butter is very special because first things first is that it is made with the top most quality milk available in this country. It has various techniques in which it's made. It's called the Niso technology where the ferment is actually added into the butter and it's churned. So I've got about, I would say 50 grams of butter in a nice pan. So first things first, what we are going to do, I have my pasanda right here. Oh yes. We have this lovely pasanda being seared. Uh, I've got about 50 grams of butter in there. Now I'm going to be adding another 75 grams of butter in here. And on the side, look what I'm doing here. I'm actually tempering or I'm actually frying the choti elaichi and the cinnamon stick, okay? So you can see there's a lot of flavor going on. Look how beautiful this is. So literally the paneer is gonna pick up all these gorgeous flavors. Next. Beautiful. So we are gonna be Nicely searing this over here, gonna get a little nice color. Okay, we are literally frying our paneer uh, along with our elaichi and our cinnamon, which is gonna be a complete, I would say, like a nice, lovely, epic dish going on here. I'm gonna be perfect. I'm putting this on the side now. Jo yade hamari jo gravy bani thi. Beautiful. The lovely President Brown butter along with our lovely onion gravy with cashew nuts and really nice spices. So we've got a fantastic pasanda happening here. A little bit of cream in this which I like to put. Okay, I want to also add a little bit of yogurt in this. So we have this amazing Paneer Pasanda ready for you and look how gorgeous this is. Nice, lovely. Finest Butter President presents the President Paneer Pasanda only by Vicky Ratnani exclusively just for you. If you like this recipe, do like, do subscribe and let me know if you want to know any kind of dishes and ask me any questions 
why and where and how to use press in butter and i'm on your team i'll see you soon